everybody. Mom vlog time. Um, so I'm not gonna lie, like, look at me right now. I thought I'd be like all those cool moms and vlog and drive. Um, actually, every time I saw people, I, every time I see people vlogging while they're driving, I'm like, oh, that's just asking for trouble. But, um, here I am doing it because I'm playing with a, a Kodak ZI-8 or whatever, which is basically Kodak's version of the flip camera, but it had better reviews, so I'm trying it out. <sighs> so today, I took Sophie to get her 10-month portraits done. It's actually, she's closer to 11 months at this point, but I'm late getting them. <laughs> so, <coughs> so Sophie, we went in there and we sat down, you know, to do our photos, and this was Sophie the whole time. She was just like this. She's like stared at the lady taking pictures no matter what. She just sat there and like stared. And I was like, really kid? You smile, laugh, jump around all the time. And when you're trying to take your pictures and I'm spending money, you just sit there stone faced. I was like, really? I mean, at least she wasn't throwing a fit. Cause there was a kid in there throwing a fit and she wasn't doing that. She was just like way, way, whatever. But anyway, it was funny. And they took her a picture um, photo in like lots of different costumes this time. Like, she was a cowgirl in one. I thought I would hate it because I don't like cheesy themed photos. But, uh, no, I loved it. It was so cute. <laughs> like, I have to be honest, it was really cute. So, <laughs> yeah, apparently I do like cheesy themed photos. <laughs> Who knew? So, anyway. Um, <laughs> but, anyway, after that, I went shopping um, at Babies R Us. And I needed a new little mini diaper bag because my other mini diaper bag by many I mean like I have a big diaper bag and then I've got like a little one for like quick trips so I don't have to lug a big one around all the time well it like had um seen better days so I went and got a, a cute one um I'd show it to you but I'm driving so anyway yeah oh and you know what I did today which is really weird um I totally did my makeup like always blah 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 then I went out and I realized like literally just a little while ago I realized I'm not wearing mascara which, like, not that it's that big a deal. I have black eyelashes anyway, but, like, that, that was just weird that I forgot to wear black mascara. A lot of times, even when I'm wearing almost no makeup at all, I'll put on cover-up under my eyes because I always have dark circles lately. And then I put on, like, mascara. And I was like, that, why did I forget my mascara? That's wacky. So, anyway. So, Kyle and I just discovered this place called the Yogurt Spot. Oh, it was delicious. It was just, like... Party. Oh, party of delightfulness. So anyway, we walked in, we didn't know what to do, and there was like this big row, our big like wall of like yogurt dispensing, and you basically go and get a cup and you pay by the ounce and you can get whatever kind of yogurt you want, right? But they don't have like, um, it was like, uh, excuse me, I know I look tired. My eyeliner's probably all smeared. But anyway, and this is probably not the greatest angle, so, but regardless. So anyway, so they had um, fun flavors that wasn't like vanilla, chocolate, swirl, as is common in most yogurt dispensing things. No, it was like, well, yeah, they had vanilla and chocolate, but <laughs> they had like cake batter and red velvet. Red velvet cake, come on. Oh, that is just fantastic. So anyway, so I got... Um, red velvet cake and cake batter. I know, right? I'm such a party animal. Then, then Kyle got just cake batter, right? Then you go up and they have like a big old bar thing set up and it has pretty much every topping you topping, you can topping, topping. Apparently I'm Mary Poppins. Toppings a bag. But anyway, um, toppings and <laughs> it was awesome. I was like, woo! And Kyle got no toppings. What? Whatever. I was like, why are you lame? Sorry, I didn't know I married a lamey. But anyway, uh, then I, on the other hand, I got mini toppings to make up for his lack of toppings. Coconut, like cheesecake bites, and oh man, I don't even know. Wow, I can't see how fast I'm driving. A cop just passed. Okay. But anyway, so it was amazing. It was so good. And a lot of times, like, I love red velvet cake, but um, a lot of times if you get red velvet flavored things, it doesn't taste very good. Like, I'm going to tell you guys a side story. So, I was really excited, um, and I bought a bunch of yogurt. You know, you see the commercials, and they're like, I lost weight eating Boston cream pie and key lime pie, blah, 
I'm not, but it's like yogurt flavors. So I did that and, um, oh, that's weird. I'm going through the security gate at my neighborhood. And, um, if you are a resident, um, you have a, a little code on your car that lets you into the gate automatically. Like it comes up and the gate was like just stuck up. That's not safe. That's not what I'm paying them a ton in homeowners fees for. Anyway, so, um, what was I talking about? Now I forgot. Oh. I interrupted myself and then got distracted by myself. But it was really good, the yogurt. It was really, really good. And um, it was cheap too. Like Kyle and I, both of our concoctions cost us like a little over five bucks, which for those of you who go to like Cold Stone Creamery, like you get one scoop with one mix in on like a cone at Cold Stone and it costs you like almost six bucks. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. It's like my new favorite place. Pretty much. Pretty much ruled. So that was my exciting afternoon. I know you guys. Are you jealous of the life I lead? Because you should be. Because I mean that's a pretty great life right there. <sighs> Alright, well now I'm home and it's 7-12 and the baby's asleep in the back of the car. And I better put up my side at the garage door. So anyway. Alright, well I will talk to everybody later. Bye y'all. Seriously? I just found my new favorite place. Like I'm thrilled by this. The concept alone thrills me. I think that if awesome was a flavor. Making me dance, it's so good. Ha, ha, ha.